All right, you guys, coming at you with another grocery haul live from Kimberly's dining room table. So we will start over here. Yes, I have stains all over this table because I have children. Anyways, um, I have eggs because we were getting low. I did get a couple of the Jimmy Dean breakfast sausage. Um, kind of broke down and get them because they're like 440 now which is absolutely ridiculous. But I went ahead and picked a couple of those up as well as some buttermilk biscuits because my oldest son loves biscuits and gravy. So I wanna make some of that for him coming up. And I got a couple of cans of the whole kernel corn. And then actually I should have probably put this over here. I have a little section over here that I got things for more just longer term prepping. So these should actually be over there. I got a couple of bean and bacon soups as well as a couple of New England clam chowders. Um, every time I do a grocery haul, I try to also incorporate some more longer term food storage items. I got four of these Wonder Breads. My son really likes these, we discovered recently. So I picked up four of those. And finally, oh my gosh, I have not been able to get this for like one or two months now. This is the only spaghetti sauce my son likes to eat. It's the three cheese prego, and they had them in stock, so I grabbed six of them. They probably will not last that long. I got the Belvita blueberry um, breakfast crackers. My mom likes these. She's going to be visiting me soon. Pick those up for her, and then I got, of course, some more fruit roll-ups for the kids' lunches. One gallon of milk, and of course, Sunny D for the children. And then this is kind of my little um, longer term prep section here. I picked up another four pound bag of pinto beans and another, I think this is, yeah, five pound bag of jasmine rice, my favorite, as well as another big container of the peanut butter. And this was actually marked down and another grape jelly. So I have some of these on hand, but I keep trying to add to that stock because my son eats lots of peanut butter and jelly. I got another children's Tylenol here, um, just to kind of add to our stockpile on that. And then I got these to go Jif peanut butter. So something I've kind of put off for a long time is working on a bug out bag for me and the kids. So I'm going to start slowly putting that together. You know, it's one of those things you pray you never have to use, but like if you needed to get somewhere, you know, just to get you through for a few days, it's nice to have a bag ready to go that you could grab and just run out the door if you had to. So. These I bought specifically to go in some of our bug out bags that I'm working on. And then I also got another Quaker Oats. This is the quick one minute oats. Um, again, that's kind of more for longer term storage because I do have some, well, I do actually have several oats on hand, but I eat a lot of oatmeal, so I do want to keep that stocked up. And then back to the normal portion of the haul, I have Italian sweet cream creamer. Again, that's my mom's favorite. And then I picked up some more of the Great Value Donut Shop, shop coffee um, K-Cups. And they've been out of this donut shop forever, so I was glad to see that was back in stock. And then up here, of course, if you watch any of my grocery hauls, you see a lot of the usual suspects. My daughter, my daughter, my daughter. These are like the three things I always look for on a grocery haul because she likes these in lunches. And of course, she's obsessed with Takis as well as these Firewalk um, stir fry Asian noodles and sauce. This particular one, they've been out of for a while. So I was happy to see those back in. So I got four of those. I am almost out of bleach. So I picked up more bleach. And then for the little doggy, uh, I like to keep stocked up on his snacks. So we got some vegan strips. Um, these are the triple flavor kebabs. He really likes those. As well as these jerky nudges, bite nudges with chicken. Got some paper plates. I have been out of paper plates for way too long, so decided to go ahead and pick some of these up because I miss having them. So I don't have to do dishes all the time. And then I got some more sparkling water. And then last but not least, yes, this is my little uh, arrow garden. Look at this. I'll give you a sneak peek. I'm getting ready to do a follow-up video. Um, and if you haven't seen my video on me setting up and planting my arrow garden, I will link that down below, but um, I have it sitting here on my table, so. That's why that's there. And I just turned the light off for the purposes of me filming this video. I also got these toilet wand refills because that's what I use to clean out the toilets. There are, I wanna say three or four more items that again are gonna to have to be shipped. Oh, I did get also 
um, bottled water, uh, one, one package of the bottled waters. And then there's three or four more items I think they're shipping, which is kind of the norm now that they didn't actually have stocked in the store. So when I get those in, I will uh, show you those items as well. Hey, you guys, I'm just bringing you back real quickly here to show you the few items that were shipped to me from Walmart. And that is the Clorox Disinfecting Wipes, a three pack. I did get the Bumblebee Snack on the Run Tuna Salad Kit. I really like these. And these are actually going to be for my bug out bag that I am slowly working on. And the last thing that I have is the uh, Blue Plus ble Bleach, the Bowl Fresh little tablets you can drop into your toilets keep them a little fresher and cleaner and that was everything that was shipped I think that was ever I don't think I'm expecting anything more but I hope you guys enjoyed this haul this time if you did please don't forget to like comment and subscribe share my videos and I will see you guys in the next one take care bye